Sometimes being Muslim isn't easy, especially after 9-11. Many people right now, they don't understand Islam. Most people have no idea what Islam really is. Their understanding of Islam is twisted. <laughs> twisted. That leaves a lot of people confused. A lot of people confused. Especially since the media spoon feeds them their scary opinion. The media? Yeah, they're the ones who make the mistakes on TV. They make the oppressed look like the oppressors, and the oppressors look like the oppressed. Wow, that sounds confusing. Exactly. Look at the error in terrorism. If you study Islam, you'll see that there's no terrorism in Islam. Think about it. Think about it. Out of the six billion people on this planet, one and a half billion people are Muslims. That's a lot of Muslims. So, if Islam taught terrorism, one out of every four human beings would be doing a violent act. But that's not reality because Islam doesn't teach terrorism. Ask yourself, when was the last time you saw a Muslim on one of those crime shows? World wildest police chase. Uh, America's most wanted. Um, how about cops? You must have seen some Muslims on cops. The guy with maybe a guy with a turban or a guy with a thobe or, or a shovel of kameez, something. Mm, I don't think I've seen Muslims on any of these shows. Do you know why you don't see Muslims on these shows? Not even one? Because Islam doesn't teach terrorism? Exactly. But what about all those scary videos they show on TV? Always gonna find good and bad people in every group. The point is, if you wanna learn about Islam, go study Islam. Don't study the Muslims. You know when two Muslims meet each other, they say, Assalamu Alaikum? Do you have any idea what that means? That means, may the peace and blessings of Allah be upon you. Wow, that sounds peaceful. So many people, including Americans, convert to Islam every single day. Including myself. You're a convert? Yeah, I'm a convert. You know, before 9-11, most people had no idea what Islam was. And most people still don't know what Islam is. They even got the stereotype of what a Muslim looks like all wrong. Did you know there's almost twice as many Muslims living in China than there is in Saudi Arabia? That kind of messes up all the stereotype, huh? Yeah. Most Americans have no idea the difference between a Hindu, a Sikh, or a Muslim. Airport security, they can't tell the difference either. Most likely, if you look Middle Eastern, even if you're not Muslim, you're gonna be searched. If you thought black while driving was bad, try Muslim while flying. Do you know what I'm saying? No, seriously. Do you know what I'm saying? If you're Muslim and you've flown, you know what I'm saying. Basically, you're gonna be searched in the airport a bunch of times. For no reason. But I didn't do anything! You know those random security searches at the airport? They're not so random. They go something like this. Hello, sir. Welcome to our airline. We're doing a random search today, and you have been selected. Do you mind if I wave my magic wand around your body? Uh, okay. Sir, it looks like we're all clear. Do you mind if I ask you some questions? Maybe check your bags? Uh, okay. Thank you. Are you planning to travel to any foreign countries today? Uh, this is a domestic flight. Sir, please answer the question. Uh, no. Do you plan to travel to any terrorism countries today? This flight's from like LA to Chicago, so I don't- Sir, please answer the question. No, I'm not. What's a terrorism country? Any country we're bombing, or we're planning to bomb, or any country that doesn't support the countries that we're bombing, or we're planning to bomb. Sir. Isn't that like almost all the countries? Yes, sir, it is. Uh, can, can I go now because... Uh... Actually, sir, you can. Thank you, sir, for flying with our airline. And please let me say, please continue to take only domestic flights. Thank you for flying with our airline. Thank you, sir. So you're done with the whole search, everything went okay, exactly what you thought. You start taking about 10 steps, guess what? The next security guy spots you. Good evening, sir. We're doing a random search today. And you've been- Oh wait, let me guess. I've been randomly selected, right? Well, that's right, sir. That's correct. You mind if I wave my wand around your body? Something tells me these searches are not so random. Once again, everyone's scared and all this so-called security isn't making anyone feel any more secure. It only causes delays and unnecessary paranoia. So if you're at the airport, please don't act weird. You're just gonna delay everyone's flight. So here are some tips. Doing any of the following actions will most likely get you stopped at the airport. Here we go. Action number one, wearing comical shirts that can be misunderstood the wrong way. Is that for me? What did I do? What did I do? Action number two, getting a heated debate with the airline about your halal meal. Look, I want to know if this meat is halal. Is your meat in the plane that says halal? I want... Look. <sighs> Look, I ordered halal food on the plane. You says... doesn't say halal here. Is the meat halal? Is the meat really halal? Who slaughtered your meat? I want to know. Please tell me his name. Does he hand slaughter or does he electronic slaughter? Okay? Please tell me his name. Huh? He's not here? Who? Where is he? He just slaughters and leaves? No. Yeah, it has to be halal or I'm not eating. I want to
not to talk to your manager. Action number three, saying words that can easily be misunderstood. Dude, the food at that place, it was the bomb. It was the bomb. You said bomb. You said bomb. What? No, 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 no. Action number four, speaking with an angry voice in a foreign language. So please don't act weird. Let us change the way the people perceive Islam. And the only way we can do that is by being good examples, good Muslims. Make dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to give us strength and patience so we may be good examples for those among us. This is Ali reminding you just in case you forgot. Ha <laughs>